Hey guys, Spider here, and we're doing Spec Ops, a new Spec Ops mission release today for Xbox COD Elite Premium subscribers only. Will be available in another month for everybody else on Xbox, as well as uh, PS3 COD Elite Premium, and then two months for PS3 regular to uh, purchase. To uh, it's, I don't know, this one... This one really isn't that interesting. I'm doing the run here, obviously, on veteran difficulty, and I'm just running up to get uh, to get pretty close to that um, that tag marker. And basically, the objective here is that we got to take the ship down, but we have to tag and uh, four locations one at a time, and then uh, plant a beacon on it. So we got to go in here with the recon drone. We can take out uh, all these dudes with the recon drone. Then we got to tag. Tag the location, and then we have to plant the beacon. All right, and these guys, like these guys, just keep spawning in. It's like the old, the old COD days where uh, we have unlimited uh, enemies unless you actually start moving up, because uh, you just can't sit there with the drone or, or with your assault rifle and and just take these guys out. I am going back to take these guys out though. Like once you actually have uh, put the, the beacon on, um, then they don't actually respawn in. At least in in this area they will further up but not in the area that you've just uh, passed by with the beacon okay so the it looks like the uh, marker location is on the right hand side this is the second marker location uh the position varies slightly but uh, or can vary slightly but uh not you know it's not going to be on the other side of the ship let's put it that way so we're just going to take care of these guys up on the right hand side and like i said it's pretty easy once you once you get it down Okay, where's this guy? Oh, he's right there. Uh, once you actually get it down, because you just once once you actually activate the uh, the recon drone, uh, you're invulnerable. Like they can't actually hurt you. Uh, you can't activate it if there's an enemy right in front of you shooting at you, obviously, like this guy, right? But once you actually have it activated, you're pretty much uh, invincible. Nobody can shoot you, even though you're just kind of sitting there with a uh, laptop, <laughs> looking at a laptop. Okay, so we're going to go over um, the... Obviously, the second one is right beside us. So I tend to uh, move right into the position, right before the uh, the tag location. And uh, that'll put you in a good position. Obviously, once you, uh, once you mark it, then you're right there to be able to uh, plant the beacon. All right, come on. Get in there. See, there's me. That's me right there, the uh, <laughs> green square. Okay, so we're going to tag it. And then it's an easy, uh, easy little uh, jog here to uh, plant it. And then I'm going to go back. Uh, actually, you can either... Um, yeah, I'm going to go back around. I'm going to take the long route just because I don't want to run into any of these guys that may come in behind me. So I'm going to go over on the side, make sure these guys are taken out over here. And then uh, we're going to bring up the drone again and come across the other side, mark it on the other side. And then we only have one left. So there are only four four markers that you have to tag. Four beacons that you have to plant. Alright, so we're going to do this. Now once you... It, it's kind of hard to do this on Veteran. I mean, I did the, uh, the achievement, drone achievement on uh, Recruit. I'll post it later. But uh, So there's actually a chopper that comes in. So I'm, I'm going to fall back here a little bit. This chopper, I'm going to use the recon drone and try and take out some of these guys first that uh, drop in off the chopper but like I said again these guys are just gonna keep uh, spawning in uh, and until I, I mark the other tag uh, it's gonna be a little bit difficult so there's three guys I think that drop in off this chopper so we'll take those guys out first and then we're gonna go over and uh, mark the tag here Come on, spider. now you can use the recon drone as many times as you want here uh, but you gotta be careful if you leave the zone you die if you <laughs> yeah so the recon drone got sh shot down or whatever so but i knew i apparently i have an unlimited supply of recon drones so it's okay you can call in another one and uh we're gonna come back in again here take some of these guys out first Use the recon drone to find it these guys the hiding in there all right let's go back around yeah drone does uh complete the mission in under three and a half minutes which was actually very, very easy on uh, on recruit. Okay, so we're gonna mark this tag. Oh, great. Now, I am a little nervous here because uh, the previous attempts 
uh, there were guys that ended up coming in and, and chasing me all the way down here, but I don't think that happens in this situation, in this uh, instance. So I'm going to go back from side to side a little bit. So it was kind of varied which side they came down after me on. But uh, it doesn't look like they're doing it this time, so I'm going to move up. And, yeah, see there... It's like I said, I'm, I'm, I know. This, I'm not doing this for time. I'm doing this to get the, obviously, the, um, the veteran achievement. So it doesn't matter how long it takes you. You're fine. That's why it's taking me forever. <laughs> and these guys are nowhere. So I'm like, all right, well, let's move up. And there are going to be a few guys up here. So this is when you want to use your flashbangs, possibly. Um, or you might want to save them for the last little bit when we actually have to haul ass out of here after we plant this beacon, this last one. There were more guys, like previous attempts, there were like way more guys the up there. So, plant I don't know. Beacon. Anyways, we're going to plant it right here, and then we got to haul ass. We got to get back to the other side of the ship. This time it is time, so this is where, you know, maybe you do want your to save your flashbangs and your uh, frags. I used a couple in here. I haven't used any... Uh, fortunately, but uh, you gotta haul ass. You gotta. You can't uh, spend too much time taking these guys out. I only have a minute ten left. Come on, go, 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 go! You can actually. You don't even actually have to go down these stairs. I'll show you when I do the drone achievement that you can actually jump over the side rail on either side to get down a little more quickly, and you don't take fall damage, <laughs> as I found out. Because I was like beat red. Uh, when I was doing it for the achievement, the drone achievement, and I jumped down and I didn't take any damage, so that's cool. So here I'm going to use a uh, frag and a stun and then just try and run by these guys if possible. These guys up top, though. Go, go, go! Veteran, this is this is sketchy. And and it's... I, I jump up. I run up here. I'm like, no! That's not the right way! Go! And there's a chopper, so you get a... Yeah, run down and then up on this platform and then you jump onto the chopper and uh, that's the mission, so... Pretty easy. Uh, I mean, I'd place it on the lower end of, of quality of Spec Ops missions. I don't know. It was uh, that's all there was to it, basically. So, and it didn't take me very long or very many attempts to uh, to get this this run on it. But uh, hey, that's pretty cool. And uh, achievement unlocked. Stay frosty. I think that one is just to complete the mission. And then the next one, Sub-Zero, is to complete it on Veteran Difficulty. Right, guys, I'll have the other one for you for the uh, drone achievements up uh, a little later or tomorrow or whatever.